Because today we would like to inform our brothers and sisters, those who are here, that we came here to celebrate the birth anniversary of two of our Masumin, Rasul Khuda sallallahu alayhi wa about Saudi Arab, Holy City of Mecca and Holy City of Medina, where there was no respect for any right baby girl used to bury alive woman has no right to get the education and there was not any right to get the inheritance. For a small reason, they were fighting for long. But when Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa he came, he changed the complete society and the entire society in the period of just 63 years and the first 40 years was it was silent public and silent Quranic teaching without introducing himself as a prophet darkness has gone ignorance has gone people got educated but again, after 1400 years, history is repeating in Saudi Arabia. <coughs> Our brothers and sisters, those who are well aware of the politics of the entire world and especially the Saudi Arabia, in 1996, there was one documentary, it was presented by BBC, the biggest violation of human rights is being Continued, it is in Saudi Arabia, where no one has right to follow his religion. There is no freedom of speech. There is no freedom of practice. There are the two hadiths I would like to share with you today, and inshallah, after the showing of this clip, inshallah, I'll address the judgment in Urdu, inshallah. Hadith from Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam Man azbaha wa lam yahtamma bi umur al-Muslim falaysa bi Muslim Whoever raised or got up or awake in the morning and he is not thinking about the affair of his Muslim brother he is not considered as Muslim Now we are talking about this great scholar Ayatollah, Ayatollah Bakir Nam. Two years before, he has been arrested. He was injured with the four bullets. And during those two weeks, that news was also spread that he was martyred. But Alhamdulillah, still he is alive. Saudi regime, they sentenced death penalty for him. What was his crime? Because he raised his voice against the oppression. He is trying to bring the revolution, revolution of Quran, revolution of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam in the kingdom of Rasulullah. More than two years. If 
Only one morning we were not thinking about this person and the people like him, those who are being oppressed in the world. So that means we are not considered as Muslim. Hadith number two. Al-alimu bi zamane wa la yuhjam alayhi al-lawabis. The one who is well aware of the situation of his time. Political situation. What is going on in East or in West? Remember always I'm telling you Islam is not only this. Okay, I'm praying, mashallah, all five prayers at time time. Of course, it is valid for you. Hakul line, hakul nas. I'm fasting, I'm going for hard I'm helping people. But brothers and sisters, Yazid people, they were also praying. But you have to raise your voice against the people, those who are like Yazid. We will not allow anyone. To come again like a Yazid, we are expecting Khomeini, 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 people like Khomeini. Like Bakr al like Ayatollah Khoi, like Ayatollah Sistani, and like other Mahal. In Saudi Arab, More meaning those who have migrated from Saudi Arabia when they came here and they have seen this Imam Baga, they are saying, Alhamdulillah, you have you have the freedom of Majalis and other land. Five times a day you have the prayer, mashallah, Shadun Amir al Mumini. Madrasa for our children, classes for our youth. Oh, that Saudi Arabia where Rasulullah he came to teach the people, but right now, no freedom. Imam Jafar Sadiq and Muslim Muslim. Those who have been in Medina for Umrah or Hajj, I am sure that they have visited that place where there was the Hova and the Madrasa of Imam Sadiq and Muslim. You will not find any visit. You will not find any monument. You will not see anything except that place is right now dumping place. People they are dumping their rubbish over there. Allah, they are the enemy of Ilm and education. They are enemy of Quran. Remember, they are not enemy of Imam Jafar Sadi. They are enemy of Quran. Bakhrun Namr, he raised his voice. He has been arrested. Just this year on 10th of Muharram, you know that there were these, uh, there were nearly seven to eight people that were martyred. That was the news which comes. Thousand of people that are in the prison. Shia, they are jobless. If someone is doing jobs, so they are not showing that they are Shia. You are not allowed to visit the Khaybar. If someone wants to go for that, show. Immediate. You are not allowed to visit the Madani Ghadir. This is Islam. They are the Khadim al Harmain. 17th of Rabbil Awal. Birthday of two of our Masumi. Coincide with Friday. Pray to Allah. With the intercession of these two Masumeen. Pray to Allah. Today is the day which is dedicated to Rasulullah Imam Sadiq and Imam Zaman alayhi salatu salam. Pray for the justice. Pray for the freedom. Pray, pray for the hands and the appearance of Imam Zaman salam, because we all are in, answerable to our Imam for our duties. Now we are trying to show this clip and thereafter I will continue.